all right man so we back out to the, the 96 caprice classic 9c1 cop car and i'm gonna take some stuff off this car man not everything today but i'm gonna take some stuff off this car yeah that rear end it's got the gu5 gears that's uh i think 323s positive spinning I'm gonna take that not these wheels I mean these tires these tires are bound bald but these up in the front man these are brand new man they and me you can see a little see a little see a little dealer can you, can you see the blue I still got blue on the inside because these since the thing is these are these are five by five and my box is five by four and three four look at that look at that look at that yeah and they're a little bit bigger i think mine are 205 70s these are two 225s so i'm gonna get these put them on every rear end swap them on the box I'm gonna get that fat ass sway bar i'm gonna get that i'm gonna get the uh the the quicker ratio steering box yes i am and I'm gonna get the rear springs off this, the rear sway bar, and what else, what else, what else? I think that might be it. I think I got brand new springs that'll work with this car. I think I do. But yeah. So. Yeah, man. Let's see, I'm gonna grab these. Check it out. It's got some goodies on it. You know, we coming up on Fourth of July weekend, man. But and they're gonna have, I think, probably forty or fifty percent off, man. But that's in another week, and I can't take that chance. That you know, I've seen them where they end up taking just the the disc brakes, or they take the posi out and leave everything else. You know, it's one forty plus twenty five dollar core. Might as well take them. Just brand new tires, man. Shoot. You know, I think they're like, like 20 bucks with a wheel, you know. So I'm going to get them. All right. In case people wonder, yeah, pick and pull does sell cars and trucks, SUVs, what have you. Yeah. Yeah. Ugh. I hate these freaking weird ass dolly things. I got the, the tires and wheels for like 50 something. 55 or something. So, yeah. I'm back to get that rear end. Oh, boy. Alright, man. We're back at the 96 9C1 Caprice. Gotta assess the situation here. Like I said, I already took the wheels, front wheel, and tires. First things first, let's have a sip of our nice Luke warm purified water here before it becomes you know the same temperature as it is out here <laughs> it's like probably like 90 something oh man you know what i think i'm gonna I'm end up swapping over these bigger brakes yeah i'm gonna try these i'm not gonna get them now though i'm gonna i'm gonna wait for that sale that's coming up. Put that parking brake on. That way I can be able to turn. Get these off. Let me see here. Let's take a quick look underneath. I'm probably gonna need that drive shaft as well, I think. Because if not, I'd have to shorten mine down and they charge like 100, 150 bucks or something or even more to shorten yours down. I've got a 204R transmission and this is a 704R. So, you know, I've got the saw though. I know I could just make quick work of those trailing arms. 
Yeah, but I don't know how much use I got in those two batteries. And I don't got the big boy batteries. I'm Team DeWalt, but you know, I didn't buy the good stuff though. <laughs> All right, man, I'll cut you back on a little bit. All right, so basically, man, so we're gonna get the wheels off. Wheels and tires, those aren't coming off. I'm gonna try to just, we gonna just, the shocks, lower control arms from here, upper control arms from up there. And that way I don't gotta mess with the uh, the sway bar here. You know, I'm gonna try to do it that way. Just gonna cut the brake lines. And I think is that it? Well, I gotta take the, um, the drive shaft, unbolt that. And the parking brake. Yeah, I gotta get that off. I think, I think that's it for this. You know, there's that, that, not much to these, so you know, uh, fairly fairly straightforward. So, all right. <laughs> Yeah, this thing didn't have that kind of power. I broke them loose first. <laughs> Maybe it's just me, but I think some of the most peaceful times I've had been just lying under a car. Not working under a car. Working under a car kind of sucks. Just lying here. Yeah. Anyways. Alright, almost got this last one out here. This last bolt's almost out. I think, anyways. Yeah, man. There we go. That's out. That's out. And let's not bust our asses here. Let's uh, see if I can hold this. Let's see here. Okay, there we go. Sorry if it's upside down. Maybe I'll fix it uh, later, but or if not, you know, you know what's going on, right? Yeah. All right, so I got the two top trailing arms out, and lower. Take the uh, the bolts off for the, uh, the shock. Still got to do the lower control arms and. The parking brake, you know, the brake and the brake lines. I had to stop and, oh man, had a little break with some of this fake ass wannabe energy drink, but I do love me my Arizona product, so yeah, I took it anyway. Nothing but freaking sugar, blah, blah. Anyways, let's keep at it. I swear, man, one of these days. One of these wrecking yards is gonna kill me. Oh god. They closed this place at six. Six o'clock. And that lady was out there. We're already closed. 5.30. We're already closed. Had me trying to rush up here. Oh crap. I don't know. What was that? Maybe an eighth of I don't know what an eighth of a mile, but it was oh sixteenth or something, man. It was oh, luckily for that for me that thing was there. That other freaking wheel barrel contraption thing I wouldn't have made it yeah but I got the rear son of a bitch all right loaded up you guys didn't see him before but the, he was a that guy right there that man that man damn near died he was just sitting there freaking uh, you know just freaking like unresponsive like a heat stroke or something I just had to get it in the car man I'm freaking dirty this sucks you know, I'm gonna change too in a second somewhere yeah see that right there Ooh. yeah check this out man it sucks i don't like doing this that's why, that's why i prefer to have a truck but crap this sucks man 
Box Chevys ain't, ain't, ain't for this type of work, man. They ain't for this type of work. No, they ain't. I think I cracked this shit right here. Damn it. Oh, well, you can't see it. Yeah, man. I had to give me a damn uh, El Camino or something, man. Fix my truck. All right, man. I'm out.